alright, I'm back in this game. It took a while, but it took a bit of finagling, but I actually got myself an account in Europe in order to get the free stuff. It's a bit unnecessary, but well, I got what I wanted, and it came with the with the box, so you know I wasn't gonna r lose lose that stuff, right? It had an expiry date. I also found out that it had a. I was complaining earlier that I needed a camera system, right? I actually found out that we do have a camera. But I was actually seeing if. Uh, yeah, here we are, photo mode. See. Alright. R up down. See? So I was just wondering what's it say here? Insert your message in container in place. Make sure to close and press the red button to send. Pressure must always be between one and two PA. Flashing light means new mail incoming. Like I say, this thing, this... Uh, gotta hold this. He's a pneumatic system. Yeah, PS4 is still chugging along. Actually, yeah, I was checking out the, board, the videos from the hotline menu. I actually found out Jesse, that... Jesse, did you get the hotline? I mean, how is it out there? The comms? The hiss? Sorry. You made it. I'm glad. Emily? Let's talk. Of course. There's more stuff buying up. I love it when you sort of sort of take over a room as a as a base of operations, right? You just sort of move in. It just sort of it's sort of interesting to see like an official place sort of get slightly converted and retrofitted. It's always interesting to see stuff like that. Uh, what a, I think you know for a PS4 and for a console. You know, this game actually has like, a lot of live action clips. So it's actually interesting to see, you know, how far we've gotten as a game. You know, you wouldn't have seen this in like the PS1 era or something like that. Initial encounters of entity known as review and invade, corrupt, and any. This is inherent in me. Pens. Fine. Okay. Well, I'm just, yeah, like I said, I'm just sort of just grabbing this stuff for puzzle. Let's see what she has to say. Answer some questions, right? I got the hotline. I can make out what Chuck was saying now. Incredible. What did he say? He talked about his management team people who knew the Bureau of Secrets. Your boss, darling. Tomasi, but he's gone. He has gone. Salvador? He's the head of security. And Marshall? Helen Marshall is head of operations. She's tough, ex-CIA. She took her rangers and went to the research sector to secure the HRA production. She hasn't come back. Someone who could help us. The other sectors. How do I get there? It's impossible because of the internal lockdown. You can perform a directorial override to lift it, but that can only be done in the maintenance sector. Normally, you take the sector elevator down there. It connects all the sectors, but it won't work while the lockdown is in effect. We already got past one lockdown. Maybe I can find a way. Jesse, look, with no prep, no training in this extreme situation. You are doing phenomenally well. And all that and the hiss can't seem to affect you. I mean, I would love to run some tests on you. If you agree, that is. We could find out something that would help us. Tests? I don't know. She might find out about you. But I wouldn't mind understanding more myself. Okay. If you think it will help. Great. I'll check the internal documentation for any lockdown bypasses. We need to get these sectors open to locate Darling and Marshall. And I'll look for a way inside the maintenance sector. The sooner we find one, the sooner I reach this override.
Do you hear that? Someone's singing. Where is it coming from? Hi, Jesse. Where did the hiss come from? I'm not sure. You said the hiss was here when you entered. Did you see anything like that outside before you came in? No. No, just inside. The source is internal, then. See, the oldest house is a sprawling complex with openings to other places as well. I don't even know where to start looking. But in the context, it's good news. The lockdown holds. The hiss escaping the building would be the end. Pretty shitty world out there if you ask me, but I wouldn't want the hiss to destroy it. I'm with you on that, Emily. You mentioned the oldest house. What is it? This building, the bureau headquarters, the oldest house, is a shifting place. I, you've seen it. It transcends its physical limits. I've been to New York a few times. How didn't I notice this place? It's an attribute of the building. This is a place of power. The oldest house doesn't like attention. So unless you're purposely trying to find it, you don't, which is perfect for us. The work we do here is essential, but unstable. The Bureau prefers not to be noticed. And we need strong walls to make sure nothing gets out. So without you, I never would have found the front door. Okay. This trench guy. I keep hearing him in my head. Is he a ghost? Haunting me? I doubt we're talking about a ghost in the traditional sense. But an echo, maybe. See, if he was killed by the service weapon, your gun, maybe it's his final thoughts recorded by the bullet in his brain, like a, a deep space probe sending back data. But that's just a hypothesis on my part. I'd need the gun to research it. But you better hold on to that, given the circumstances. I think I will. Yeah. Can you tell me what an object of power is exactly? This is all, well, new to me. <laughs> Don't worry, I love going over the basics. So objects of power are mundane objects that house paranatural energies and have developed a link to the astral plane and can thus be controlled, which is what differentiates them from altered items, which are still housings of paranatural forces, but are more volatile and cannot be bound in the peri-utilitarian sense. Got it? Did she memorize this? Got it. Thanks. So HRA stop you from becoming a hiss. It seems that way. I, mean, I hadn't even heard of an HRA until a few weeks ago when Dr. Darling started handing them out. Well, I began analyzing mine as soon as I got it. I and mean, each one it seems to emit a powerful short-range frequency way beyond anything I've ever seen. Doesn't the timing seem suspicious? I thought that too. Dr. Darling usually likes to unveil his latest breakthrough in big presentations. With these, he just passed them out. Yeah, his behavior makes me wonder what exactly he knew. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. Just let me know. My face is up. Uh, I think. I'm not sure. I don't even remember these being here. I just looked up this big, this much. Uh, dudes. Yeah, have you ever heard of the Metroidvania? Because that's what describes this sort of game. It's kind of funny. I've finished Bloodstained a little while back. Sounds like it's coming from the elevator. Objects up to 20 feet. Bullshit. We never recorded any distance over five. Obviously, you never read the P6 data. And as I was saying, I finished Bloodstain, which is the same thing, only is 2D, so it's kind of funny. Just the thing that I'm still playing the same genre after all this. Construct Shatter. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a shotgun, and then I have to farm for that. 
Steward Construct. Okay, so it looks like you just sort of randomly fresh. Okay, this is going to need some staring at a little bit. I'm not sure what I'm looking at right now. Though I do need to upgrade this in a bit in order to move on from commons. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to have to play around with this in between videos. Excuse me. Alright. And there's other trees here, but it's not finished yet. Fifth free form fifteen free. So let's see. Let's see what I need. So this I'm probably going to be using launch a lot anyway, so. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, there's a lot of messing around to do. Alright, so these are just a cheat well I'm not sure what they're called in game. They're not I wouldn't call them achievements. You see this in Wo in Wolfens in the original Wolfenstein as well. Yeah, so anyways, it's just sort of uh, passive build up. So anyways. Into maintenance section. From the elevator, she said? Except this is the way then. Like I said before, the janitor is a friendly face. much farming for points I have to do in this game. Though I don't want to try it too hard. I don't want videos of me just running through and just killing enemies over and over. No fun for that. Just try and get through this game right. I never 
record this. I always my video keeps outputting for The maintenance three. sector is the janitor domain. If I can find Ati here, he can help me reach the override. Maybe it was you who got me into the oldest house with the lockdown on. Maybe it was Ati. It felt like he made the elevator appear that took me to Trench's office. Is Ati guiding me too? Just messing around. I was saying, I keep putting out 30 frames per second even though I have this Elgato. Maybe my stuff is old? I don't know. Either way, it's kind of annoying that I'm not, that I'm not putting out what, the best quality video possible, but... Well, at least you can watch this, right? <laughs> oh, bo I have to activate the board countermeasures, huh? All right. Search for the fix. Victor, we never got to know. Yeah, I thought so. This even the books are weird in this place. They're not agreeing on what sort of book this is. <laughs> oh. There's also uh, uh, all right. Let's see. Anyways, my mistake, I should have. I should have gone to a control point earlier. Turn that thing on properly. Well, I'm sure I'll meet something soon. Oof, what a mess. This map would have been better if I had a zoom or something, right? It's not. It's kind of hard to orient because I only can use my camera to guess what's way forward. Well, it's better than nothing, but still. Ventilation in janitor's office. The directorial override is right there in the control room. That? How do we get there? Yeah, very pleasant.
Didn't take any time at all. Spin. Hmm. See, there's a lot to do, huh? Uh, I'm always getting a bit of gas when I'm playing this. It's a bit annoying. I guess this is the anxiety. Oh, yeah. Not too much to do. Should I? <laughs> yeah, it is a problem. Anyways, let's turn these on first. Oh, only three at a time. Huh? Hmm, looks like this stuff. Yeah, alright, so I do lose them, so I should have done that. Anyways, it's not a big deal. These are really low level mods right now, so it's not hardly anything. <laughs> I never get anything of headshots. <laughs> Let me see if I can upgrade anything. Should I get a shotgun, or should I just get more mods. This is gonna take a while to farm up. I'll probably get both sooner or later anyways. Projectiles, ammo refund. Hmm. This sort of thing I have to add uh, attach much later. Reload speed. It is reload speed compared to ammo refund? Well, no, that's just recharge. I'm sure I'd get that some other time. For now, I think the important thing is more damage. Recovery, energy boost. Yeah, <laughs> they just <laughs> these conceptual materials. Huh? Yeah, she does a little spinning thing. That's so neat. Anyways. We probably could have used a HUD for this, huh? So no, so we could see. You know what? You know, sometimes you might get a bit confused. Like, sure, you only have two weapons at a time, but still, you can get confused, right? Pretty decent range.
I think I mentioned in another video, I like the graphics when they die and they sort of flow away like that. Something you just don't see anymore. Well, you couldn't see in older games. It's just that sort of graphical mag magic. What is my mod? Personal mod. Health recovery. Health boost. Energy recovery. More health. I got actually. This is what I got from the from the exclusive stuff. I don't want to use it just yet. It's cheating, right? Energy recovery. No, oh, no, I don't really need this. Uh, try that for now. I'm not sure what if some players like playing games that are predominantly indoors or predominantly outdoors. I can see some people play, be getting a little claustrophobic just doing this forever. A little bit too low. I tried playing Doom Free for a while, but you know I just didn't like it because it just is if it, it felt too claustrophobic. I mentioned, it just keeps going on forever. It's like uh. I get, well, I'm not very good with horror games anyways, right? So I didn't really like it so much, so I just... Hmm. What's down that point. way? Yeah. This way? Alright. Makes me nauseous. An object of power. How do you think it got down here? Well, it's corrupted. That's a carousel horse. Why is kid stuff always so creepy? needs energy. Right. So having energy in generation would be very useful, right? I'm not sure about tying a dodge to an energy meter, but I guess once you upgrade all the way, it won't be such a big deal. I 
god, this game is gonna keep surprising me forever. <laughs> game. Recoil efficiency. I'm gonna have to sit down and already ma manage this stuff later. There's a seat still connected to the when things are in its path, bound by. Hmm. At least these people actually do their jobs, right? I wonder where they're actually contained for that matter. Good thing I'm getting so much of this. I don't. I really don't want to farm too hard, right? Launch efficiency. Is this? Yeah, this is launch efficiency. I have. Should be an energy bar. Ener oh, it's only five percent, but still. Energy recovery. Okay, I probably use that more. Hmm. There's many different ways to measure DPS, whether it's getting more bullets down the line faster, having the bullets do damage directly. <laughs> it's really hard to say. Unfortunately, the only way to do f do this is to actually unlock more bars, right? I don't know what, what grip can do later. I mean, it's just a generic handgun form, right? So I'm not really sure what, what you'll get out of it later in the game when it's fully upgraded, right? For congratulations. Yippee, Sadana. It happened in the last drop. I truly need an assistant. Funny thing is, I've been a janitor. I'm more at home in that role than as the director. Only Ati here seems to see that. Yeah, hi, Ati. Look. We need to get the lockdown lifted, otherwise I can't get to the other sectors. Can you help me get to the override? Yes, yes. Easy peasy. It's just around the corner. But first, we need to get you working. Very small couple of hours job. Something tells me it's going to be more than that. Aha, aha, you think there's a dog buried in this? I can tell you are not the yesterday's Krause's son. That's why you make a great assistant. Very well. I'll hit the facts on the table. Now, Magnus that this house has a vermin problem. A bad one. They've already messed up the cooling pumps. And the uh, power generators of a power plant, Berkele. And the pensioner inside is starting to feel the band around his head tighten. The situation needs to be fixed before the plant blows up. And we all disappear like a fart in Sahara. Trying my best to keep up with this. Fix the coolant pumps and the power generators, otherwise the power plant will blow. But oh, don't you worry. I've left you clear instructions. You'll catch the end of the threat before I go to my vacation. The works on the task board here. You can do later. Then you have time. Vacation? Right. Yes. No one's gonna cancel my holiday or seeds gonna rattle. 
But don't worry at all. You'll take care of it and soon this crisis gonna be last winter snow. You better go now, so you don't have to run with your head as your third leg. The door in the back leads to the plant. The door in the back. That's great. Thank you, Ati. Yep. Burn the dress. Throw it in the fire. Burn it all. If I find a Burn it into a reindeer, not into a moose. You do the best you can to clean to make a place homey, right? So I don't have to go back for the office. Oh, it's time for a coffee break. So. Mm, I don't see a. I don't see a quick travel from here. Even though you know you have a board full of jobs. I guess we just have to do the best we can, right? Okay, so what happens again if that thing blows up? Power. Explosion. Too much. Director's duty. Keep the lights on. Alright, I have to look at that later. And I'm just paying every video just because, right? Are you new? Just go talk with Chief Arish in the security booth. He's in charge here. Ma'am! Hey! Chief Arish, FBC security. Shouldn't you be in a safe room? They all have HRAs. We're on the same side. My name is Jesse Faden. I'm here to perform the directorial override to get the lockdown lifted. Yeah, yeah, Chief Arish, FBC Security. I'm just... Oh, hang on, you're the new director. <laughs> um, it's a pleasure, ma'am. Let's skip the formalities, please. Right. Faden, ma'am. Look, as you can probably tell, uh, it's a bit of a shit show down here. We've been holding our ground, but whatever's gotten into our buddies has them wrecking the coolant pumps and the power converters. The NSC keeps overheating, and... 
My crews keep getting shot before they have a chance to make any repairs. NSC? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Bureau jargon. It's what we call the power plant. You know, the uh, big rumbling metal thing? <laughs> uh, Salvador, head of security, asked me to protect it in case of an attack. So what's inside is dangerous. And Dr. Darling seemed to know it would be a target. Darling? He's here? No, he came down a few days ago, before everything went to hell. He was out of it. He smelled like a bar mat. He was ranting about vulnerabilities and how he only had one large-scale HRA, but that he needed it somewhere else. Still, at least he gave us these personal HRAs before he left. Hey, did I mention that he was tearing his clothes off? <laughs> Crazy dude. Darling knew the hiss was coming. Listen, I love playing 20 questions as much as the next guy, but we have got to get the water and electrical systems repaired before this baby blows. I'll have my guys unlock the doors out of here for you. I'll take care of it. You stay and keep the hiss away from the plant if you can. The hiss? That's what we're calling them? Oh, that's catchy. Oh, listen, the radios aren't working, so if you find my boss Salvador out there, could you please ask him what the plan is? I'm sure he will have one by now. I'll keep an eye out for him. He sure has a lot of faith in his boss. Try to stay alive. In pipe. There's someone in the room asking to tell him. Any person who intervened with his day to day. Everything else would be there to deal with. Three points. I wonder how you get those, but I guess it's just C through F. Is the clock back? Now. Oh man. Audi is gonna be so pissed. conversions well below the acceptable percentage. I'm itching for some real action. No, I don't say that. You know what's gonna happen? Shelters. Are these actually save points or are they just are they just rooms or flavor? Cause I actually tried like, I guess it's sort of like a soft save. It's not going anywhere, so I guess we gotta go up the path. This is definitely gonna turn into a battle arena later. cheese that spot. Anyways, yeah, this is gonna turn into a battle Look arena right. later. Director on deck. It's kind of hard to make the right choice, right? Another 50? Yeah, I guess there's 100. Okay, but I want this one first. Okay, yeah. That works. I'm out of house memories and ritual impulses. Ritual impulses and thresholds. Yeah, and you farm these from enemies, I think. 
Oops, house memories, fresh ones. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna sh I only have one slot for everything right now, so there's no point constructing random mods. But I do have to start getting ready to upgrade this stuff because higher levels obviously help more. I gotta save up. Alright, I guess janitor is faster to go. Well, it's hard to say janitor's office. So it's just a bunch of shortcuts I have to rely on. go around right this sort of reminds me of Half-Life remember that stage where you have to go kill that uh, what's it called the, ten the tentacles See, this is why you need a dodge button that doesn't need energy. It's too busy. Maybe it en encourages you to use more dodge efficiency. To use more, what's the word for it? Use the ha guns more, but still, you know, I, when you're in the middle of throwing shit and then you need to dodge, I don't think it helps. Anyways, I think we also need more clear signs of when you're switching weapons. It's a bit random right now. It's sort of good games need like a good audio cue in order to make so you can tell for sure. Power cut. Replace the parts. I actually cheated a little there. I actually knew, I actually found a bit of beforehand that you can use launch in a certain way to kill the enemies real. Those flying enemies a lot quicker. Is this the right way? Looks like it. Why are you throwing, by throwing something before it reaches your hand? I like that sound.
I mean, how do you get headshots with the constant? It's been a while since I had some nice old fashioned shooting action. I like that sort of introduction to new rooms, it's very really nice. something like this. The clock is blocking the pipes. You need to deal with that shit. He is very clever. He is trying to sneak you. He got him caught with his hand in the fist trap. I'm guessing I'm going the right way. to fix this thing ASAP.
Water the pipes? Nothing more satisfying than any more What do they say about these guys? Once when they yeah, it explode of course. Adaptive response to HRAs. Jesse faded. Uh, interesting spell. It's funny that you can make so many different designs out of human profile. There's any model viewers of these guys. There you go. Apparently, we just hit these guys, they drop to drop health. <coughs> Excuse me. All black outfit. Not sure about this sort of that sort of loop. I could have used there some more color coordination or something like that. Yep. See? I knew it. Always a boss. bit of a muscle memory to reload a square button, so I keep switching weapons when I do this.
When the converters and coolant pumps are working again, we should be able to get this baby back down to a safe temperature. I hope. What do you know about the Hiss? Not much. Only what I've seen. Well, they use the same tactics that Marshall and Salvador taught us, which makes me think that the Hiss haven't completely erased the people inside, which is a pretty fucking horrible thought. Or they're just using whatever they find in their victims' heads. In any case, they are really eager to get inside the power plant. Why do you think that is? Shit, I don't know. They want to make my life harder? What do you do here, Arish? Security chief of the maintenance sector. I make sure all the weird shit down here doesn't bother the maintenance crews. Learned everything I know from Salvador. The best security agent this bureau has ever seen. And you like your job? I love it. You know, everyone thinks that maintenance is the lowest rung on the ladder just because we fix pipes instead of writing memos, but I gotta be honest. These are the bravest people in the goddamn building. I'm proud to work with them. I've done a few odd jobs with these kind of folks. They say what they mean. I like that. What exactly is the power plant? Listen, I only know what Salvador told me, but I know it generates all the electricity for the Bureau, and it's got two very simple rules. Rule one, keep it below a certain temperature. Rule two, don't ever, ever open it. Oh, and three, uh, it's classified, so I shouldn't ask. Sounds like secrets are standard operating procedure around here. Oh, yeah, it's all part of the job. What do you know about the service weapon? Not much. The thing is director only. Salvador told me about the time he saw Trench use it. Sounds like that gun can do some serious damage. Yeah, I did see pictures of it once, though, and uh, it looks different to that thing you're carrying. You monitor something? It's new. Is new a good thing? Given the circumstances, I'd say new is our best bet. Do you know this Ati guy? <laughs> Of course. He's my favorite coffee break buddy. Dude has got some crazy stories. And he probably knows more than anyone else around here. You can make sense of what he's saying. Any idea where he's from? I'm guessing Sweden. Uh, he's from where he's from. Look, there are just some stones that are better left unturned, you know? I should be going. Right. You got a lock down to lift. Remember. <laughs> I said I left these guys alone. I hope you're doing okay. essential
Ah, uh, good sounds, good sounds. I got a lot of points too. Hopefully I can hang on to them. First thing first, right? The furnace. Field training. Spin. Grouping. Sounds like the accuracy is a little bit wild with that gun. So, but well once I unlock it and everything else, right? I heard that there's some bugs in this game. Hopefully there's been patches to fix this. Otherwise, a bitty bit of a shame. But if it's so... Oh, this place is gonna come down! Obviously I'm not going in there. It's the wood. Oof. I saw it in that other room as well. Uh I think we've not yet. Astro constructs. Hmm, interesting. I don't think... Oof. Charge mode. I've never seen that. So do, do, do I have that ability yet? No, I don't have charge yet. I'm not sure what it does. I took that guy out. So. Wait, I gotta upgrade this anyways. Let's see. Spin. No, uh, not quite. I do have enough for that, but not enough for ritual. Alright, so I gotta keep. I don't want to mess with these yet. I, I want to work with my baseline weapons, right? Mm, grip, house memory. Yeah, I gotta keep farming these up. There's a lot of these to get. This may, it will take a while.
damage after a kill. Damage go well. Recoil. Hmm. Yeah, I really needed to get more slots for these. And just really help a lot. It's right up. You need to fix it before the old trick pants inside the plant has a shit fit. I still use muscle memory, I keep thinking that reload is square button. Obviously not, I just recharge it, it's weird. Yes. It's throwing that jump at me. When are they going to get ambushed in these? There's some health in there. Oops. All right, <laughs> right in the back. See so if I have the next checkpoint. About an hour and 18 minutes in. Well, we keep at this until I fix the power plant at the very least. I think I'll probably do a break, anyways. Thank you. 
It's kind of weird to repair and they're just throwing junk into it. I tend to forget, I tend to miss the obvious. Let's go lift the lockdown. I'm so used to locked doors being unpassable in this way that I just don't realize you can just jump. Still on a winning streak. Games, probably poker or something, right? This is what we came here to do. I'm gonna get ambushed doing something generic sooner or later. That's it. The other sector should be open now. I think it's time I told Emily why I'm here. I'll risk it. You two should get to know each other. Anyways, I think this is probably a good time to take a break, or at least I'll stop recording for now so I can get this video processed. So I'll probably do a bit of minor sub-quests in between videos or something. Just, who knows, at the very least I still need to do that furnace job, so I'll take a break for now and 
see what I can, uh, yeah, I see. pause here for now. So I'll see you in a little bit, alright? Hope you enjoyed it so